Welcome back to Mango Plays Summer in Mara. And um, yeah, let's check for, to see what quests we've got. Something fascinating must happen soon. We got to talk to Bram, um, talk to Nakapo, talk with Ed again, and Black Trash, and talk with Onzo. Wow, we need to do a lot of talking. Let's start with Onzo. He's closest. Hello. How are you doing? Oh, uh, there's nothing about pumpkins in my diary. I don't know anything about them, not even what they look like. But I got some seeds. Good, I'll grow you some pumpkins then. Okay. Wait, I'm loving the seeds that we're getting. It's great. So, we need to do that for Onzo. Edigan is over this way, if I remember rightly. Yeah, there we go. There's the planet above the bank. I really do love the um, artwork here. It's great. All right. Kid, you asked me for ink. Now you have to give it back. Hey, you are supposed to say please. Yeah, you really are. No, you owe me that ink. And there is no need to say please for things that are owed to you. Um, yeah, I disagree with that. You told me to always be polite no matter what. You only have to be polite with adults. Um, what if you're going to ask someone for something? I did you a favor, and now you have to return it. Come on. Seriously? Yeah, I agree. Um, new jar of ink. Ow. Do I have to buy it from somewhere? Hmm. Okay, and... Oh, I'm needing to eat. Uh, let's... Yeah, let's have a mushroom soup. We've, we've been living on juice. Oh, no, let's have some... A dessert. Yeah, I definitely think it's about time I had some... Mocky? Uh, dessert made of rice. It can last a long time. Oh, oh, we're fully fed. We've actually had solid power. How do you feel? Oh, I bet she feels good. Oh, yeah, I'm, I've never been... That's the wrong thing. Um, I've never been a fan of the juice-only sort of diets because i think i'd miss chewing too much to do it i have a lot of admiration for people who can but oh yeah no chewing it feels integral to eating <laughs> in the end it wasn't that bad right mm? no no he seemed to like my dish but now he gave me more tasks oh come it turns out that in order to be a cook i have to learn how to do a lot of things he asked me to place some torches along the way to the beach. Oh boy. I think I'll need some materials. <laughs> could, could you help me? Uh, we can now make fabric. Collect some wood and cloth so Brown can make the torches. Okay. How do I make... <laughs> um, yeah, alright. I won't forget stuff. Whoa. <gasps> we can now cook on this island. Oh. Oh, yes. What do I want to cook? <laughs> I just want I want to cook something just so I've done it yay oh I love it and do I need to talk with you um, Taka oh. oh come on don't bother me what's wrong I need some fresh products for the bar so I'll grow them myself oh. what should I plant first why don't you start with peppers I can get you some seeds can we good idea okay where do I collect pepper seeds from? Goa, why are you offering my services in this manner? I'm not a fan. Oh, dear. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's... I guess let's go home. Ah, fast travel. <laughs> um, oh, we're almost out of fuel, are we? Okay. No worries. And, um, ugh, there we go. I made it onto the pier. Napapo, apparently I have to talk to you as well. Hello. Napapo, would you like some more paints? Uh, yes. Okay. Let's go to the market and ask there. Or maybe we should ask Noho. Let's see. Okay, who, who's Noho? I might be... Ig Ah, that's no ho. Okay. Who's blue? That person's new. Ooh. 
All right, so let's um, prepare. We've got to do some things around here. A little bit. We've got to get some farming done. Get some collection of food. No, I'd like to pick up the orange, please. Thank you very much. I really do need to Google how to get rid of old things. We've got the harvest. Oh, so much good things. I do really like the fact that our hose got that much better. Right, okay. Only two more to collect. I was getting this for Fred originally. Ah, maybe we can use it for cloth now? Um, hmm, yeah, we'll need to look at the recipe. Okay, right. So, let's plant our pumpkin seed. There we go. Ten days? Whoa. Okay, well... It's not a rush to get this for Onzo, I don't think. Onzo's quest still very side mission, not main quest. So we can do it whilst we're here and, and just allow it to happen. No rush. I like the fact um, on this game, because there's so many places that you can go out exploring, that the plants will just be fine. You, you don't need to worry about whether or not, you know, you need to water them each day. So you can spend several days on different islands. Um, hopefully that will be the same for our animals because... Um, okay, what else do I need to do? I need to... Oh yeah, I need to go look at how much wood and cloth I need. Uh, workshop. Here we go. Cloth fabric even is made with bread. So, how many things can I make from my cotton? Ten. That's not too bad, I guess. And then, let's see. How many do I need? Three of fabric. Okay. Can I make three? Oh, look at me go. Right. And then, how many wood? One. Okay, so that one's done. Um jar of ink. Can we make that in the workshop? Apparently we can. Water and squid. Hmm. Haven't been able to capture a squid, so I'm not going to worry about that quest for a bit. Um, going to ask Wheeler about boat models. Pumpkin, pepper seeds, and more paints. So it looks like we've got to go... Back to the other island. Um, but maybe I should just sort of run around here. Oh, yes. I also need to fill up my tank. There we go. <laughs> I filled the tank. Yay. I, on the way through, I collected all of the minerals in here. So it just makes sense in my little head. And actually, look at my energy. I think we should sleep before we head across to the other island. Just purely because sleeping in our boat does not give us as much energy as sleeping over here. And hello, seeds. I like it. There we go. Come on, let's go to bed. Bless you, Koa. You need to be rested for the rest of um, the days. No, for the rest of the mission for today. So, Quailus. I should have watered the pumpkin before I left. Oh, I'm silly. But there we go. Stuff happens. Right, okay. The fruit getting off. Ah, oh, no. I like how they look at you. <laughs> like, oh, what's Cora doing now? Right. Hello. Mm -hmm. Go away, Cora. I'm using, losing money with you standing here. But I was hoping you could... Ah, uh, maybe I have to talk to him in the shop. It's closed. You used to open at 9. Or 9.30. Hmm. Oh well. I guess I am going to go speak with uh, the guy in the mansion. I've forgotten his name. Hello. I am ready to be polite. You again. Caleb sent me. Oh, I see. What do you need? He asked for a boat model. 
Are you sure that he doesn't want anything else? Hmm. Yes, I'm sure. I imagine that you don't know, but Caleb has a lot of money. Like, a lot. Uh... He and Noho amassed a great fortune during their travels. They were really good merchants. Really? Um... They don't seem like it. Here, take the model. It's not worth a lot, but I'm sure he will like it. Thank you. Wow, he gave it to us without us having to pay a fortune? Oh my word. That, I feel, is unheard of. <laughs> Maybe they're going to stop taking advantage of me. Hmm. Somehow, I think not. Oh, let's go see this new person as well, whilst we're over this way. Ah, Onzo, you're here. <laughs> wow. Okay. So, let's look. So, this is now correct. Maybe he appears in both places now. And blue is up here. Okay. Blue, hello. Hopefully, you're not feeling blue. Oh, very. I will take the free food. Hello, Napapo. Where is this blue fellow? I don't know, but there's trash down there. Um, I, was, I, thought, I thought this was a person for a second. I feel like the game might be lying to me. What happens if I just walk off? Whee! Nope. Not underneath. That was what I was kind of thinking, was maybe it was an underneath type situation. Ah, oh, dear. Right, what fish go? No. We got to practice fishing for squid. Hmm. Mm. Go away, go away. I'm losing money with you standing here. Okay, so maybe I need to buy the green and purple. Is that what I need to do? Get more paint. Purple and orange or brown? Unsure. Okay. Let's see. What can we sell that you like? Ooh, you really like dragonflies. Have those three. And you really like the lava. You can have those three as well. And that will give me enough. Oh, achievement unlocked. Bargainer. Oh, okay. 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 All right. Good. good. Uh, no, wrong. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't like this whole having to press multiple different buttons. <gasps> I want the singing fish. But for now, we will have this one. And you can have um, your boat. Aquila gave me this boat model. <laughs> really nice, thanks. You're welcome. Did he ask for money? Um, now that you mention it, no, he didn't. Right. Are you thinking about not paying him? Yeah. I gave him some money a few years ago. It's enough to cover the expenses of every model he could get. Oh boy. <laughs> That's the longest sentence I've ever heard from you. Sure. <laughs> oh my god, did you see what we got? Um, I forget, how do I do this? Uh, yes. Um, e. No. Oh, you just cycle through them. Ah. Oh, I love it. Right. There we go. We've got a new backpack. Thank you so much. I love it. Mm. Toa. I have to bring some money to Edigan. Can you do it? Mm. Sure, I'll take care of it. And I won't steal even a penny. I know. Mm. It, it was a joke. Sure. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Wow. So technically, we could seal it. And then just not complete the quest. But no, I'm going to be... I'm going to be good. We, we were just given this beautiful backpack from him. We cannot stinge Caleb out of this. I can't do it. Um, let's see. No. Right. Don't accidentally spend the money. Deliver the money first, then you can go spending. Oh, hello, doggo. I brought Caleb's money. 
Good. His debt with the bank is now is settled now. Debt? Shortly after I arrived at the island, Caleb asked me for a loan. He then built the shipyard by the harbour with that money. And he's been paying me back since then. He is my best customer. <laughs> wow, that's nice. Someone told me that he has a lot of money. Oh, I certainly agree. He has a lot of money. But he doesn't use it. Here, give him this receipt. Now we are even. Okay, Caleb's ticket. Ooh, may look at it. Uh, where will it be? Special, maybe? Caleb's recipe for a mysterious dish. Ooh, okay. That's kind of cool. Right. Now I want to find the orange crayon. Hello. You don't sell crayons. Do oh. you? There we go. This one. And I have enough money for it. Nice. So I just need to take that back. Drop that off for Napapo. Um, and drop off to Bram. Oh, I feel like I'm starting to get organized for this game. I love the fact I can just leap across. <laughs> Hello. Please go ahead and forget anything. I, I haven't. I've got it all. I, I was pretty sure I did. I need 20 wood. Oh, uh, okay. I, I will be back. I thought I had 20 and I needed one. What? Oh well. Let's deliver this. Um, and then we'll go home. Hello. Caleb, here's your receipt. Everything is paid now. Hmm. I'm glad to hear that. Aquila told me that you have a lot of money. Why did you ask Edigan for a loan? Hmm. The bank had a special offer. They gave me crockery with the loan. And couldn't you just buy the crockery yourself? Hmm. It was limited edition. Really beautiful. No, I didn't like it that much. <laughs> Here, take some coins. Thanks for the receipt. Did I have the recipe? <laughs> oh, dear. All right. Home we go. Hey. Napapo, I've got you the crayons. Hello. Oh, I love your little <laughs> top. I got the paint. Yay. Hey, but don't paint the boat. Oh, I'm sorry. Yaya's rules. I don't mind if you paint boat. Hey. Oh, Napo is happy. This is good. Right. Okay. I need to do some smashing. Apparently. Ooh, that was cool. Oh, there's more of them. Okay. I need to do some harvesting around the island and. Then I will be back. Oh, look at that. It's raining. We have pumpkins and apples. Wow. Okay. And did I manage to get enough? Wood. I did. I was making some boards. Or oh, hopefully a little experiment. And uh, yeah. So I, I just kind of wasn't sure if... Um, I'd accidentally used my log. Sorry, Bram. Okay. Let's check this out. Oh, apples. Yay. Oh, this is all good. Right. I also did a lot of tree harvesting and farming. And it's a rainy day. So we really should take advantage of picking all of these mushrooms. Because um, there's apparently a thing called mushroom soup. <laughs> Hopefully we'll get a recipe for it soon. That'll be great. Um, yeah, I just basically have been farming and harvesting all of the items. This stuff regrows so quick that actually I think making money isn't too difficult on this game. It felt horrific to begin with, but actually I've got sort of a better understanding because you can sleep whenever you want it takes you to the next day and regrowth just happens of items you can see the tunnels completely 
repopulated and I've, I've harvested that a couple of times. You've got mushrooms on rainy days that have good price value. So it's not really a worry. You just sort of run around your own island or uh, foraging away, making sure that you plant your seeds, your tree seeds. They take about a day and a half to grow until you're at a point where you can harvest them. I got some new tree seeds out of a barrel. They kind of look like birches, birch tree. And they said they were acorns, which should be an oak. Um, I'm very confused. And yeah, so I, I planted those there, waiting for more seeds to come before I, I tear them down and see what their resource is. But, yeah, pretty much all good. Pretty happy with how it's going at the moment. I'm going to go grab the shrimps from the beach. And then we're going to head off and continue with the quest. Oh, no shrimps. Okay, I won't grab them. Right, so I'd like to go to Guaylis. We will see... Um, what we can do with completing the quests and stuff. Okay, right. Do this correctly this time. Whoa, hey! Ram, I'm here. I, I did get the 20... I, I mean, 20 logs is a lot. All right, but I did it for you. It should be enough to make tor some torches with these materials. Mm. Thank you so much. Bruh. You're welcome. Even the best chefs need some help. Yes, yes. Don't tell my uncle, bro. He insists on making me do all this by myself. Hmm. I'm here for anything you need. Thank goodness. You're welcome. Do we get anything in return? <gasps> Ooh. We did get something in return. Thank you. I mean, I can't afford to make it now. But, you know. She nicked all of my materials, but all good things come to those. Right. Okay. I need to talk to these two to get new missions. Might as well whilst we're here. And then, as a final thing, we're going to go look at another island. We're going to go explore the world a little bit. Um, What's wrong, Grum? Hmm? My uncle asked me to get rid of this old fridge. We're getting a new one tomorrow. More powerful. I can take it. He wouldn't mind. If it's still working, I can take it to my house. <laughs> I would love to have one and make ice pops. If it works for you, brr, come back and I'll give you a gift for the inconvenience. <laughs> That's exciting. So we got a fridge. Build a fridge on your island and go speak with Bram. Okay. Cool. Thank you very much, Bram. I don't mind um, having this. Hello. I can talk to you. Ah. Excuse me. Sorry, can you give me a hand? <laughs> I love your hair. I do, I do. Pink hair. Love it. Oh, thanks. I was thinking about getting some highlights. Huh. I'm Mun from the Space Rangers. Ooh. I'm on vacation. I'm afraid that I've lost my travel backpack. Don't worry. Hmm. I'll find it for you. I think that cat child stole it. It's not like I have anything important. Just clothes, but I would like to get it back. Um... Sure, I'll go and ask. Ah, that cat child. I was like, Onzo wouldn't do this. No, but Mayo will. <laughs> right. We won't worry about that one. I just saw the little glowy dot on her head. And I was like, ooh, okay. And Caleb, what do you have to say? Hmm. Oh, uh, Tucker called me because he wants me to repair his oven. Can you go and get it? Mm. How am I supposed to carry an oven? Yeah, because I'm carrying a fridge. Put it in your backpack. It won't be that heavy. Ah. Um. Okay. Well, do you know what? Packers just round the corner. Ah, I, I don't know why they can't go do this. Good old fetch quest, eh? But, I mean, I can now cook here. Yay. I can only cook one at a time, though. That's annoying. But I guess if you're in a pinch, you can. Hello. Um, oven support service. How is your oven? Oh. Broken. Did Caleb send you? That's right. 
He told me to bring it to him so that he can check it. <laughs> it's all right. But tell him to be careful. I don't trust his clumsy hands. Well, Tucker, you don't trust anyone, do you? And your eye is still twitching. It's really creepy. Why? He is a merchant. And suddenly now he is fixing things? Oh. In a nutshell, I'm not very confident. Okay, we will be careful. One oven. So, oh. oh, look at me go with an oven and fridge in my backpack. <laughs> I love it. Alright. Hello, Caleb. Have have an oven. Here is the oven. Let's see. Um, what's wrong? I broke it. Oh, Caleb. What? Just a bit. Oh no. A little bit. <laughs> it's not a big deal. <laughs> I would need metal, screws, and a couple of tubes. Akaji, the blacksmith. She should have some. I'm going to get everything. Take some money. Oh, thank you. Ooh. Okay. Cool. Well, I'll do that next time. I'm interested in going exploring. Navigate. What? Napapo is not here? That's weird. She always stays near the sea. Where did she go? Maybe she went to the temple to get the fuel. Uh, search for Napapo in the abandoned temple, Quailus. Okay, well, I, I guess I'm not going traveling. Napapo! Ruining all my plans. Right, here is the temple. Oh, it is blue. I was looking for you earlier. Hello, Napapo! Nampapo, there you are. No, you're looking at the wrong person, Koa. <laughs> Hello! Who's this? Hmm. Blue, they call me. But that's not my spirit name. Okay, so it's not your spiritual name, but it's your real name? I um, uh, had a really interesting conversation with Nampapo. Hmm. You talked to her? Nampapo told me how she found you. And that you are her best friend, Koa. Oh, Wow, how do you know my name? What did you say? Ah oh, yes, I will tell her. You should pay tribute to the Fountains of Mala, the spiritual sap of Maura. Okay, you mean the Fountains of Fuel? It is not just fuel. Mala is life. Now that you mention it, I haven't been very respectful. I just took it without giving anything in exchange. You were doing it very well. Oh. Not that good. You feel miserable. It's normal. We all need to feel angry sometimes. Hmm. We need to be angry. You can't carry the weight of the ocean on your shoulders. How? Now go pay tribute to the fountain. Bring it your fruits and vegetables. Your best lettuces. Okay. Um. Oh, I think I have lettuce. There we go. I don't really know why I'm here. Yaya always told me these stories about the guardians and Mara. Mara this, Mara that. Mara is the only the sea. It's not that important. Although, I thought the same about the fountain. And they seem to be important for the people here. The Mala emits a special energy. Sammy insisted too much with all that talk of responsibility. She talked like my Yaya. Maybe I should listen to her. Everybody here seems to be in need of help. They should help each other and leave me alone. <laughs> I don't know why I bothered leaving my island. Oh, that was a lot of emotions that just happened. There. <laughs> oh, um, hello. Think. Hello, are you lost? Um... Not at all. What a funny girl. Are you from here? Yes, more or less. That's good. Where are your parents? They're not around. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. Could you deliver a message to your chaperone or the adult responsible? I guess so. <laughs> I'm Fink Shin. I come from a far, far away planet called Diva. We are looking for beautiful places in Mara to acquire as property. Mm -hmm. If your dad or chaperone has a tiny house or field, we'd be interested in buying it. Well, I have an island. You? How? 
It's tiny, but I like it. Mm -hmm. Could you give me the address? I don't know if that's a good idea. Yeah, don't do it, Koa. How much do you want for it? Nothing. No, don't... No, 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 no. Now he's going to just take it. Koa, 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 no. It's my island. Okay, good. Good, yeah. But we have a lot of money. Mm -hmm. Do whatever you want with that money. Like buy a mansion with a swimming pool. I'm not interested. Nobody rejects the elites. One way or another, we'll find your island. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. No inhabitant on this planet is of a high value. You only have your tiny boat and tiny houses. I'm not a fan of Fink. I don't know what the Baron expects to get from these miserable waters. We should burn the whole planet down. Wow. Be careful what you say or I will tell Sammy. <laughs> is that a threat? Yes. <laughs> I'm looking forward to leaving this place for good. We'll meet again, Brat. What an unpleasant person. Mm. I should tell Sammy. But I'll bring her an afternoon stack so she'll forgive me. Okay. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, That was random. I don't know where I think appeared. Ah, there you are. Mm. How could this happen? Our stations are perfect. All right. Cool. Um, do I need to talk to this guy again? Uh, build fridge, screws. Talk to Napa. But I saw it a minute ago. Get the next mission. Okay. Um, what? What's that? Mm -hmm. Oh, a pole, maybe? I don't think there's anything there. It's just a hole. It's always been there. Um, an earring? All right, let's talk to Blue. Okay, so Blue can translate. I like this. Um, Blue, I think that Apopo wants something from me. Hmm, yes. Let's see, okay. She says that on your island, there's a passage leaving, leading to a cave full of minerals. Yeah, I use it a lot. Maybe you could take advantage of it. Leading to a cave? How? Oh. It's inside the mountain. Um. You'll have to build a mine. I don't think it'll be easy. Uh, who's that? Oh, the blacksmith lady. Ah. Yeah, that's a really good idea. All right, let's ask her for help. Ah, oh, I was going to go explore, but now I want a mine. Oh, dear. Oh, I have your pump. Have I given you your pumpkins? Let's go talk to you and see. <laughs> Oh, there's too many quests to keep track of. I see that you brought some pumpkins. They are huge. Imagine them to be about the size of a peach. In the future, if someone keeps on with my diary, I'll make them look for you. Uh, Writing down the big, big pumpkin, ask Koa, the human adventurer, about it. <laughs> wow. So someday, if someone reads your diary, they will come looking for me. Something like that. And I'll be an old woman. Um, I'm sure you'll be a great woman. Thank you, Onzo. Have fun. Hello, I've heard rumours that you will do me a mine. Do me a mine? Build me a mine. Something. Nah. Hey, Akajay, do you know how to build a mine? Mm. A mine? It could be dangerous. Understood. Mm. With a mine, you'll be able to extract the best minerals much faster. But it can run out of minerals, so don't exploit it. Also, remember to always give thanks to Mara. Mm. Got it. Understood. Here, take the blueprint to build the mine. Thank you, Akajay. Okay, build the mine on that. Um, I also would like some metal tr nails, screws. Oh dear, this is going to get expensive. Oh no, this one, please. You like a box of chocolates. You also quite like stone. Okay, have some stone. Uh, have some resin. There we go. Have some clay. Don't think I need clay for anything at the moment. Right, let's do that. Then I. Oof, dear. How much do I need for you? Two metal tubes and four screws. And I think I need six nails. I 
And you've only got five now. Okay. Well, let's grab as much as we can afford. Yeah, all right. And, um, quick travel. Home we go. Let's go see how, um, this mine will be. Oh, nearly missed it. The jump can be painful. Hey, a cup of Napapo, even. Um, oops. Oh, it's rainy. Right. Where... Do I need to put this mine? Somewhere in here? I'd like to take the mushrooms, please. Somewhere in the mountain, through the cave. Hmm. Guess I need to run around and find where it needs to be. Would have thought it would be obvious, but who knows okay so i think i've worked it out you can just straight up build the mine it's in here we need 12 boards we have the metal we don't have the rope i think i'm actually going to build the chicken coop because that was what i was working on build next and as i said um we will have a quick nose at a another island I have to feed the animals first. Okay. Uh, what animals? And how do I feed them? Hmm. I guess we just wait and see if chickens turn up now that we have a chicken coop. Hmm. And, um, yeah, let's build our fridge. Find flatter terrain. Okay. Well, you know what? Ugh. Oh yeah, I can rotate with weirdest. Oh, this is the weirdest way of um, placing things, I have to say. And such strange controls as well. Oh, can I just move it straight backwards and forwards? I have this need and desire for things to line up. All right, don't move. We got a new recipe. Coconut cocktail. Ice. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, yeah, maybe I'll put it a bit far back. Ignore that. It's a feature. <laughs> okay. Sleep. All right, let's have a look at the map. And let's just go... West. Whee! Hello. Let's see what we have out this way. Oh, it's nice to see our island from this angle. I like the bridge. Ooh. Oh, we got some money. These these little things are amazing. What's this? Recipe. Did we just get... Oh, wow. That's how you get chickens. Woo. Alright. I'm a fan. Rosa Island. Ooh. Let's jump out and have a look. See what's here. Hello. Somebody has um, lost a fried egg. <laughs> What's this? Can I get a better shovel, maybe? What's the point of this island? Tell me. Tell me now. Ah, hello. Um. Mess with the crabbo, you get the stubbo. Signed VK. <laughs> and some nails. Oh, I love it. Um, can I nick stuff from in here? Oh, here we go. Diving goggles. 
I think you need a new goggle every time you dive. That's kind of the understanding I've got from it. Um, we can fish here with dragonflies, which I don't think I have. I sold them all. Oh, and there's apples and another crabbo. Hello. Oh, right. Okay. That's the same crabbo. So this one is another crabbo. Where is it? I saw it. So, hello. Was I? Ah, there you are. The Sivende and Galerina Pequina. I am not going to try the rest because, yeah, no. That seemed like a recipe. That's cool. Oh, it was something cooking related, I think. Uh, we got some apples up here. Um, it's a sweet island. But yeah, we. I think we managed to get a chicken from this expedition. Let's have a little bit of a swim out. And away we go. Right, so there's another flag here, which means that we could go diving. Two days from now, and it will be our second anniversary. But you won't be able to read this on time, will you? It's okay. No matter when you open this bottle, I'll be there for you. Time means nothing when we love each other. Oh, but there's no name on that. Who? How would the person know? It was for them. Hmm. <laughs> right. I'm kind of digging this whole exploring and, and, and breaking the boxes open. But I think what we'll do is we'll more up here for the this episode at Rosa Island. And we'll try the diving in the next episode and do a little bit more questing, exploring, all of those good things. Hopefully you enjoyed the episode. If you did, don't forget to leave me a like. It really does help. Subscribe if you're new. And obviously you enjoyed what you saw. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know anything you want to see. And um, as always, I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.